Open the way for perfect expression and true place in your life. Through the wisdom of your subconscious mind, you can attract the ideal companion, as well as the right business associate or partner. It can find the right buyer for your home and provide you with all the money you need and the financial freedom to be, to do, and to go as your heart desires. It is your right to discover this inner world of thought, feeling, and power of light, love, and beauty. Though invisible, its forces are mighty. Within your subconscious mind, you will find the solution for every problem and the cause for every effect because you can draw out the hidden powers. You come into actual possession of the power and wisdom necessary to move forward in abundance, security, joy, and dominion. I've seen the power of the subconscious lift people up out of crippled states, making them whole, vital, and strong once more and free to go out into the world and experience happiness, health, and joyous expression. There is a miraculous healing power in your subconscious that can heal the troubled mind and the broken heart. It can open the prison door of the mind and liberate you. It can free you from all kinds of material and physical bondage. Necessity of a Working Basis Substantial progress in any field of endeavor is impossible in the absence of a working basis which is universal in its application. You can become skilled in the operation of your subconscious mind. You can practice its powers with a certainty of results in exact proportion to your knowledge of its principles and to your application of them for definite specific purposes and goals you wish to achieve. Being a former chemist, I would like to point out that if you combine hydrogen and oxygen and the proportions of two atoms of the former to one of the latter, water will be the result. You are very familiar with the fact that one atom of oxygen and one atom of carbon will produce carbon monoxide, a poisonous gas. But if you add another atom of oxygen, you will get carbon dioxide, a harmless gas, and so on throughout the vast realm of chemical compounds. You must not think that the principles of chemistry, physics, and mathematics differ from the principles of your subconscious mind. Let us consider a generally accepted principle. Water seeks its own level. This is a universal principle, which is applicable to water everywhere. Consider another principle. Matter expands when heated. This is true anywhere, at any time, and under all circumstances. You can heat a piece of steel and it will expand regardless whether the steel is found in China, England, or India. It is a universal truth that matter expands when heated. It is also a universal truth that whatever you impress on your subconscious mind is expressed on the screen of space as condition, experience, and event. Your prayer is answered because your subconscious mind is principle. And by principle, I mean the way a thing works. For example, the principle of electricity is that it works from a higher to a lower potential. You do not change the principle of electricity when you use it, but by cooperating with nature, you can bring forth marvelous inventions and discoveries which bless humanity in countless ways. Your subconscious mind is principle and works according to the law of belief. You must know what belief is, why it works, and how it works. Your Bible says in a simple, clear, and beautiful way, Whosoever shall say unto this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart, but shall believe that those things which he saith shall come to pass. He shall have whatsoever he saith. Mark chapter 11, verse 23. The law of your mind is the law of belief. This means to believe in the way your mind works, to believe in belief itself. The belief of your mind is the thought of your mind. That is simple. Just that and nothing else. All your experiences, events, conditions, and acts are the reactions of your subconscious mind to your thoughts. Remember, it is not the thing believed in, but the belief in your own mind, which brings about the result. Cease believing in the false beliefs, opinions, superstitions, and fears of mankind. Begin to believe in the eternal verities and truth of life, which never change. Then you will move onward, upward, and Godward. Whoever reads this book and applies the principles of the subconscious mind herein set forth will be able to pray scientifically and effectively for himself and for others. 
Your prayer is answered according to the universal law.